Hello guys, Luna here, back with another Starfield Guide video. We already covered the five best ships you can buy, but what about the best ship upgrades? Today we're taking a look at a bunch of unique vendors who will sell you all the different parts you need to fully upgrade your ship. There are lots of overlapping items, but these six vendors will have every part covered. And in terms of unique parts, there are really only two important ones, the engines and grab drive that are limited on where you can buy them, but every other vendor will sell all the other important stuff like core, shields, and weapons. So then really the main parts sold by the unique vendors are the habitats and structural components for your ship, which I will list at the end on where you can find all of them. But first, let's go through every component and where to buy them to make your ship the strongest and most overpowered it can be with the best upgrades. First, the biggest thing you can equip on your ship is the reactor, and there's no doubt about what the best reactor in the game is. The SF-40 Sheared Flow Reactor gives you a massive 40 reactor power, which is higher than any other one. Now, I currently have the second best, the SF-30, and that's because the level 40 is level locked, and you won't unlock this until you're around level 60. In fact, you might not have the SF-30 unlocked, that could also be level locked. But no matter what your level is, if you're looking to equip a reactor, the SF-1s are the best you can buy. And once you unlock the better versions, then you can replace them all the way up to the SF-40. For weapons, every vendor will sell you the same things, including a bunch of rank 4 weapons. However, the best weapons really just depend on your playstyle and preferences. I personally have the Auto Alpha Beam and a bunch of PBO Auto Alpha turrets, and they both deal huge damage, and you can take on an entire fleet of enemies with just these two weapons. But if you're simply looking for the biggest damage stats, then the 280C missile launcher does the most overall damage. The Firebolt 4000 suppressor is best for electromagnetic. The Marauder 115N Railgun turret does the most hull damage, and the Dragon 261SX laser turret for shield damage. Next, for the best shield, we have either the Vanguard Bulwark shield, which is what I have, or the Assurance SG-1800 shield generator. It does have slightly more shield capability, but it's also twice the weight, so you can equip that one if you don't care about mobility. The best fuel tank is the M50 Ulysses HE3 tank. It has the best fuel to mass ratio of any of the fuel tanks at 10 fuel to 1 mass, where the others, the Atlas and the Titan tanks, only have a 7 to 1 ratio. For engines, you have multiple options. The SAE5550 engine, it has some of the best thrusters and manoeuvring you can buy, but unlike some of the other engines, it only takes up a small amount of space and is very lightweight. You can purchase these from most vendors. However, if you truly want the most powerful and don't care about weight or size, the Poseidon DT230 engine is the ultimate engine. Now, like the cores, the best version of this engine is level locked, and I currently only have the 220 unlocked. And if you're looking for this, you can only buy it from the vendors in Deimos Staryard, Gagarin Landing, or in Cydonia. But to fully unlock this, you will have to level up your character. Next, what about grav drives? The NG340 grav drive from Nova Galactic on Titan is the best and the only Class C drive to use 12 power, giving you the most grav thrust and health as well. Lastly then, we have some unique equipment. Head to the key and the Crimson Fleet vendor, and he will sell you unique equipment, comm spikes, and conduction grids, and scan jammers. Now that we've got the legacy... So guys, now you have all the most powerful ship equipment, you can now build your favorite habitats and structures to make your ship look as good as possible. And to do this, you can visit each of the five ship manufacturers and they will sell you different parts. First is Nova Galactic, found at New Homestead on Titan. Got anything? Next to Deimos Staryard is the main HQ for Deimos parts, and this is located around Mars. Next. Here to turn you That's probably why the EC missed. Hope Tech, located on the Valo system in Hope Town. Certainly 
Lastly, head to Neon where you can find the headquarters of Stroud, Eklund and Teo Astro Engineering to get more unique habitats and structural components from those manufacturers. So there you have it, all the unique vendors and where to get every best part for your ship. There are of course a bunch of other vendors who sell ship parts like the ones on the Red Mile, Sidonia and Gagarin Landing, but they won't sell anything that these six vendors I mentioned will sell. But guys, like and subscribe for more Starfield guides and I will see you in the next one. Bye. You ready to it's so nice to have you here. Absolutely. Thank you.